actually don't really feel like reading right now, which is rare for me. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to play a board game. Um, I'm actually going to play one of the unlock games. Now these are kind of like escape room games um, where you can play them solo or you can play them with a group of people and you have to like solve puzzles and you have a time limit, you have an app on your phone that goes the entire time, you can input codes and there's a lot of stuff you can do. Over the weekend I played the um, Adventures of Oz. This is uh, this was my first time playing an unlock game and I enjoyed it. It wasn't my favorite, like there's definitely like some problems with the unlock games. Some weird ambiguity on how you can interpret certain things that makes it hard for for you to feel certain that you're doing things right. Um, I'm going to try this one, which is the Nautilus Trap, and I'm going to try this uh, as a solo. I've heard it's not great. I've heard it's actually worse than the other one. But I'm going to try it as a solo and just see if I like playing it solo um, because we have a lot of these like floating around in our board game groups. So I think it might be something fun for me to try and see if I need to get my hands on some other ones because my cat is playing with my earbuds. Uh, because I know that we have some floating around, so... Uh, I'm gonna do that instead of read for the next little bit and see if I like it. Yep, this is what we're gonna do. Toothless is gonna help me. I'm not actually gonna play it solo. He's gonna help, I'm sure. <laughs> I'm about to die already. This is awful. What is this? There's twos and an eight and a four. What am I? What? Okay, it's it's automatically popped up a thing that says, "Hey, you're d you dummy." Um, okay, I found the four numbers. Do I add them together? Oh, it's there's this. I uh, get it. Oh my god. Okay, so that's sixteen. I need oxygen. I'm running out of oxygen. <laughs> I'm about to die. I don't have enough time to find the card. I screwed this up already. Uh, 81, 81, 81. Dang it! I was right there! Oh. Get a few extra minutes of oxygen. Look carefully throughout the Nautilus. Maybe you'll find more scuba tanks. Stupid game. Okay. I'm gonna count that as fine. Listen, I was I was over by like three seconds. It's okay. Um God. Okay, so where am I? I'm here. Let's go to thirteen. Oh wait. Ninety five, not ninety one. I didn't look at it. Not cheating. Not cheating. <laughs> I hope I don't get something that's just like, you are wasting time. I'm going to take three minutes away because this is a good idea. This game's stupid. Hey, sweet books. Some Poe on here. Gotta love some Poe. Oh, man, Mary Shelley's Frankenstein. I love that book. Do I, do I want to risk looking at another one? I don't think I do. I think it's just going to be like, you're wasting time. I'm not doing it. Not doing it. Just going to waste time the old-fashioned way. By literally sitting here and wasting time. Okay. There. Um, no. Because a green wouldn't even be on that, would it? Stupid green. Shut up, phone. I'm sick of your ominous music. Do we want to read Moby Dick? I mean, if we're going to go out, might as well go out reading Moby Dick, right? It seems most on theme. Um, what am I doing? I think I would dig this a whole lot more if there wasn't a timer going on right now. I think I would be into this. Except for timers suck. Stop it! You're too ominous right now. 14 minutes and 40 seconds. At 14 minutes and 40 seconds, what am I doing? Screw it. We're reading Moby Dick. Okay. Um. Ooh. Ooh. Ah, ha, ha. I found more oxygen. Yeah. Only 
only gave me like 10 minutes. Bull crap. Oh wait, that's why I went to go here. Okay. Oh, I'm so confused about life. <sighs> yep, that's a thing. <sighs> what kind of crap was that? Okay. Because it didn't match up with what it was saying. Never mind. Um, so, I can get rid of all of this. I'm not even caring about the timer anymore. The timer's broken. <laughs> I'm just drowning. It's fine. <laughs> all right, I got all these stupid things. Oh, 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 oh. Got it. Okay. Let me make sure I have this lined up correctly. This is so finicky. What is this crap? Two, five, three, eight. Oh, okay. I mean, it's not telling me to enter in a code. Toothless, what do I do? I love you. You're beautiful. Get out of here. Like, I literally just don't know, like, even what puzzle I'm trying to solve right now. Okay, so I can get rid of Toothless. Here, hold that card for me. Thank you. Why are you clawing? It's not your scratching post. So probably something I don't want you to be digging your claws into. Well, you did it. Three, seven, six. Four. Take the in card. Congrats, you finally made it to the open air and found the wreck of the famous Nautilus. Score this. I got two stars. <laughs> There's a whole bunch of other information on there. I'm not entirely sure what it means. I got two stars. Uh, uh, I don't know, there was a lot of like lining up cards and like placing stuff in patterns. No, no, no. My final time, it says, was 84 minutes and 53 seconds. I screwed up four times on the codes. Never screwed up on the machines. And then I had two of, like, the fatal, like, you lose time because you're wasting it. Crap. Huh. And apparently six hits. I still felt like I had fun, even though I was frustrated the entire time I was playing it. <laughs> I think it's the timer. If I just don't worry about the timer and just allow myself to lose, then it wouldn't be nearly as stressful. That was my, my playthrough of Unlock uh, the Nautilus Traps. And uh, I don't know if, was this, is this fun to watch? I don't know. It was fun to play. I feel like you got some good goofs from me. So, who knows? Maybe I'll, I'll edit this together and like upload it as a, a separate standalone thing. Because 